Well, hello there friends and welcome to my video. I am Mickey B. Have we met? If not, it's nice to meet you and if we have, you know, it's always good to see you again. I'm here today, I'm slipping in another live Timu haul and this live is a sponsored live Timu haul. I have two orders to share with you. They're pretty relatively small. One is a part of the Autumn Looks campaign and the other is just random items. So I'm going to start with the small one first and I'm going to share. It's only about six items in there, but I think a couple of them are pretty good items. So um, you might find them interesting. I don't know, but let's go ahead and jump into this video and find out. Now the first item I'm going to share with you is this pair of earrings. Now I'm always looking for a good pair of earrings on Timu. I'm not going to give up trying and so I tried to step it up a little and buy more of like the sterling silver ones, try to get away from the under one dollar earrings and you know pay a couple more dollars to see what I get. So this is what the package looks like. This is what it came in and uh, let's go ahead and open it up. It comes in this cute little container. They sell these boxes separately. Um, you've probably seen them before, but I like how they do provide it uh, to you in this container because it protects it. Because as you see, these earrings do have somewhat of a rhinestone on them. And if you see right here in the listing, it does say real sterling silver. So that was another reason why I went ahead and selected these. And I do like hoops and I'm looking for a more exciting pair of hoops. So inside the little box, it has a Ziploc bag that they come in, in addition to this one. So let's go ahead and open it up. And let's see here. Now these are pretty nice. These are much nicer than any of the ones that I've ordered before. I can tell by the way that they feel. I can tell by how they look, how the clasps look the shininess of the material. Now, let me give you a close up on the rhinestones if I can. Where's, I had a little, oh, here we go. Let me see if this is, if I can use this to um, put it on and maybe I can hold it a little steadier for you. So you can kind of get a good idea. Well, I don't know if it's coming through, but it's a pretty good quality earring. I mean, you see the picture on the screen and I like how it feels. It's not all bent up like I normally get where when you do it like this, they're like slanted to the side and they're not connecting. So this definitely feels like a sterling silver. I like how shiny it is. And I like how smooth the openings are. And this is actually the perfect size for me. I don't like them much bigger than this. This is about the average size of an earring that I like. So for four bucks, that's not bad. Now I paid, actually I paid, well, this is a sponsored haul, so I didn't pay, but these were $5.29 when I selected them. So right now they are $4.49. And these I could tell I'm gonna like. I would recommend these, they're nice. They have the little bling rhinestones in them. Again, um, the price is right, they're sterling silver. And let me show you a couple of pictures that they advertise these, so you can see a little better than what I'm showing you here on my in my live um they give you an example it's about the size of a quarter which is about correct they are the perfect size for me and what else do they say about this it makes a good gift but the main thing is it's real sterling silver so if you have any allergies or anything like that um this is probably a pair of earrings that you might want to try so that's the first item I want to share with you. And I'm actually happy with these. I know I'm going to like these. So let's go ahead and put these away so they stay protected in their little box and back into the Ziploc bag. <clears throat> the next item we're going to talk about is this item here. Let's see. I got everything organized, so we're not going to have a lot of slip ups tonight and I'm calm. So here's the next item. Now these I'm excited to wear. They are a pair of shoes. They are these shoes. I think this is a nice looking shoe and I got this shoe for walking. Also 
if you look at the sole of this shoe, it's pretty thick. So it's going to absorb the impact if you're pounding on the pavement or cement. And um, so that's what attracted me to these shoes because I do have, I just did a collaboration and those shoes were really nice and they had a nice thick sole as well. And, um, but I watch the DC Foot Doctor on YouTube and one of the things he always says in regards to your shoes is never wear the same pair of shoes twice. You always want to mix them up. So I try to have a bunch of different pair of shoes so that there is no chance of any fungus or anything developing in the shoe. Um, so, but I like a shoe that's going to absorb the impact. So this is what it looks like. And I, I thought this was a nice looking shoe. I like this style of shoes. They're comfortable. Let's go ahead and close this window up real quick so we can see it in its glory. So you can. But I think this is a nice sleek look. It has the little shock absorber here in the heel. Um, there's the bottom. It has a little grip and traction. I hope it does anyways. It looks like it will. Um, but the only problem with this shoe is it runs large. So I have to give this to Jenea. I ordered another pair that's not sponsored, but because I liked it so much and you know, she has a job where she's on her feet all day and she's been complaining. So I says, well, perfect. I can give these to her and then I'll go ahead and I bought the exact same pair. Plus they had another color, um, that was on sale for, I think five or $4. So great, great deal. So I went ahead and hi, Sandra, how are you? I'm doing very well tonight. I tried to slip in here and, you know, get in and out unnoticed, but it's good to see you. Um, but yeah, this shoe uh, is too big. I ordered it a half size big. I think they run true to size. I ordered a nine and a half. I normally wear a nine. So nine and a half for me in this shoe, my foot is swimming in this. You can see it looks pretty big. But I paid for this shoe $8.39. And as you can see right now, it's uh, selling for $8.37. And speaking of which, let me just show you the other colors that this shoe comes in. Here is the black option. And then this is the option that I got, which is now showing for $13.57. And then here is this blue, I mean, uh, blue, gray and black option, which I don't really care for that look. But this one right here, this one was knocked down to $5 at one point. So I ordered this one as well. And when I get that one, I will be more than happy to haul it. This red one I kind of like, but they've never dropped it to a price where I wanted to pay. Don't really care for the white version. And this is my favorite one of all times. And it did get knocked down, but I was too late to get it for the 4 or $5 range. So, but I'm happy with this one. Um, and when I get my pair that I ordered for me for my right size, I'll be happy to try it out and see if it really is as comfortable as I'm hoping it is. But for right now, it's going to work out well for Jenea because she needs a good shoe that's going to absorb the impact. So that's that. Sandra, if you're still there, let me know if my volume is good, if my audio is good, because sometimes I don't know if my mic is too close or too far away. And then let's move on to the next item here that we're going to share today, that I'm going to share with you today. And the next item is this right here. And this is something that I was excited to get because I need it. I need it on a regular basis. Um, I need it because when I'm working out at the gym or with my trainer, if I overdo it sometimes, my knees really get uh, stiff sometimes. If I sleep wrong, my knees will get stiff when I wake up. So I actually tried this last night and I just plugged it in and I wrapped it around my knee and it was a simple, it comes with this cord. This is connected to the actual knee pad right here. And okay, thank you, Sandra. This is connected. And so it's, it's connected in this pocket right here. So it doesn't come out. So when you're done with it, you fold this cord up and you stick it in this pocket. Now, then you are going to need a, depending on where you're using it, you're gonna need a charge block. Or if you're near a USB port, if you have some new appliance that has a USB port on it, 
then you can just plug it in there. But it just uh, Velcros on the back and it has a pocket here to where if you wanted to use it like for um, a cooling thing, you could put something like if you had an ice pack or something, you could put it inside here and just use it that way. But I actually used it last night and it works really well. It has three heat settings and I put it on the hottest one and it just relaxed my knee. Now the thing about this, let me show you on the listing. I thought that I ordered this one that says hot compress and massage. So if you order something like this, make sure you order the correct one. Cause you see that one goes up to $14.39. Now this one was what's the $10.99 is the price that it was when I picked it. So, and that was this, just the regular hot compress one. So as you can see, it's on sale right now, you know, a buck or so cheaper. But if you want the hot compress plus the massage, then it's going to go up to $14.39, which I also ordered that. So that's going to be coming as well. And I'm looking forward to trying that one because that ideally is what I wanted. I wanted one that heats and massages. It probably just does some sort of a vibration. But the heat felt great. And probably when the weather gets really cold and it's winter and we're working out, I think you're going to really like it. Hello, April. Welcome to my haul. I'm glad you caught me again. Um, good to see you. And I just started. So, but yeah, this is going to come in handy um, when it gets cold. Now, one thing I want to say about this and a couple of items in my other haul, I had mentioned on one of my hauls that I did before that I had received some items they weren't in their original packaging and that was these shoes for this sponsored haul and then that was um, this for this sponsored haul and I had mentioned also that I reached out to the program what is all this stuff I had reached out to the program and they took care of everything so I just wanted to make sure I made that clear because I, I was not happy I reached out to them I explained the situation they immediately fixed it, apologized, and everything else. So I just wanted to point that out. So now I feel okay to go ahead and haul it. But I did want to let you know. They checked with the factory and figured out what was wrong and why I received these things that appeared to be returned or used. So they took care of it. I'm happy. We're good. So I wanted to rectify that because I did complain about it. And I do like to come in and update and let you know that things have been um, resolved. So yeah, that heating pad was great. I highly recommend it, but I'm looking forward to trying the one that has the vibration or the massaging in addition to the heat. The next item I'm going to share with you is this. <clears throat> what is this? It's a little, I, <laughs> this is something that I just thought was cute. And you know, you guys know I lost my little dog, Lacey. So every time I see something with a little paw print, I think about her. And this was cute. It's supposed to be a mirror cleaner, mirror cleaner. And like when you get out of the shower, let's see, it says um, household cleaning sponge, dishwashing sponge, dishwashing, bathroom stuff, bathroom accessories. So I'm looking, when I saw this advertisement, I kind of felt like it was to clean like the, like a magic eraser kind of a clean. And then I also thought like right here, it looked like it would be good for condensation when your mirror gets foggy when you're in the shower. So that's what I kind of thought this was for. So I'm going to try it in that sense and see how it works. And in addition, it just looks like it's a mirror cleaner anyway, but it's so small and it's just a cute little item. So I wanted to go ahead and give it a try, but it comes in this bag. It's right now 98 cents and I paid 99 cents. So pretty much the same price. Let's see. Let's go ahead and see what it feels like um, in my hand. If I could, I see the opening. Right. Okay, here we go. So let's see what it feels like. So it's real hard. It's thick. It's hard. I don't know if water's going to solve. It does have plastic on it. It looks like it has, okay, it does have plastic, like a plastic coating. That feels sticky. I wonder what that's about. I'll have to read up on this because it's sticky on this side. But this side is not. This side just feels kind of foamy. 
So I have to figure out how that works and what the sticky part is about. I guess the sticky allows it to just stick in on the mirror until you need it. I don't know, but I'll find out. But yeah, that's a cute little item. I think I just needed something to kind of get to my goal price-wise. So that's probably why I picked this in addition to the little cute paw print that it had on it. So let's go ahead and move to the next item. And that's going to be here. I've got everything on the screen ready to go. This is the next item right here. It is another pair of earrings. I am still trying to find, see every time I buy, this is a pair that I wear all the time. And every time I buy this pair, it says it's sterling silver, but they all start to turn brown. So I'm like, they're not sterling, because sterling silver doesn't do that. I could see it's bronze underneath. So I'm gonna try this pair, which again, this advertises real sterling silver, 527 and what I, I paid, or, not I paid, but the price is here somewhere. I don't see it. Oh, well. I guess I missed writing it on this one. I feel like I paid maybe $4 or something, or it's probably close to 5 Okay, so I thought I was prepared. It's always something. But look at the nice box that it comes in. Um, well, first of all, let's look at this and see. This is what they look like close up. Again, pretty comparable size to this first pair that I just showed you guys because these this is about the size that I like. I don't really like too big of an earring. You see it uses the quarter here as an example again. Um, anything else special about it? Those are the three different sizes I guess you can get. This must be a medium or maybe it's the large. I can't tell by this listing. I know it's not the small. This must be the large. Let's go ahead and open it up and see. But let's also look and see. Small is 597, medium 597, and large is actually 527. So this is probably large knowing me because it's the better deal of the three. Um, so let's go ahead and open it up and see what this one looks like. So here's the box. It's a nice little box that says, best wishes. I don't know. There's some tiny print on here that says something. Best wishes. Remember, you are my angel forever. Happy every day. So best wish wishes. Remember, you are my angel forever. Happy every day. Happy every day. Okay, so let's go ahead. And I don't know if you can see the glimmer, but this box has a real satiny kind of shiny glimmer to it. So it's a nice box that it comes in. Very nice if you were going to give this as a gift. And then, oops, and inside it has like the little velvet thing where you can, does it have holes in it? You can kind of punch, see the slit in there. So if you wanted to put them in there in some kind of way or a ring or something. Here is the envelope that they come in that went flying and inside this envelope who is hey stephanie how are you stephanie from Sacktown. <laughs> how are you doing this evening i hope all is well with you and you and your family and the weather isn't too hot for you because it's burning up out here in la man i was hot today okay so this is what they look like and just the plain old earring but definitely a much better quality than I've had on any of the other ones. The closure is nice. It's straight, it's not all bent up like the cheap ones. It's a nice tight close, a nice tight fit, and it's just the right size. So I'm looking forward to wearing this and it not turning brown because I'm not having any luck with these earrings turning brown. So it really comes in two Ziploc bags like this but they have one in one bag and then they stick. How did they have this again? Oh, and then they folded this one like that. And then they put the other, then these two here. So they kind of each came in their own Ziploc bag and then put them together like this. So yeah, I'm looking for, I think these two pairs of earrings that I have in this hog are definitely gonna work out for me. Because like I said, I'm trying to step up a little of what I'm choosing because when you go with the cheap stuff, you're going to get cheap, you know, results. So again, 
uh, $5.27. It's a great, great price. That's probably what I pay. Boy, it's getting cold here. I'm in a sweatsuit. Really? Wow. I have to talk to my niece. She didn't mention anything. I talked to her today, and she didn't mention that she was cold. But I know your weather is a little different from here. But today in, uh, out here was hot. I walked the dog, and I'm still hot, actually. But um, we're going to move. We're going to work through it and get through this haul. But let's see. So the next item I want to share with you is next in line. It's the last item in this haul, actually. And this I can't wait to use. I'm going to use it right after this haul, and I hope it looks good. And it is this item here. My bathroom door. See like the one in the picture? Something keeps touching my leg. Like the one in the picture here, let's make it large. I thought this was really nice. Yes, yeah, I think that's a nice print for a bathroom door. Seven, 67 was our high in North Carolina. In North Carolina, 45 now. Is that what that means? In North Carolina, it's 45, but 67 was your high in Sacramento, April. Um, let me know. Let me know what you're saying there. Oh, Okay, it's April who's getting cold. Okay, I'm tripping. <laughs> I thought that was Stephanie saying it was getting cold. April, you are cold and you are in the sweatsuit. Okay, yeah, you're in North Carolina. That makes sense. You're, you're far away. Um, that's where Janaea moved to and then she moved back home. She loved it out there though. She liked the, um, the sound of those cricket things. What do you call those cricket? Big old, they make noises. They start with a C, I think. She said she liked those things. I'm like, well, you can have them anytime. You can, anytime you want to go back. But I know you know what I'm talking about. They're your little summer bug thing. I can't think of the name now. But moving on, this, isn't this a nice print to put on a bathroom door that's just plain white? And my bathroom door is not as decorative as this door, which I like this door. I would love to upgrade my doors to a door like this. Hey, wavy like the ocean. Finally, you caught me. How are you, special friend? Good to see you. Good to see you. Um, and she's saying hey to all the ladies in the in the cicadas. There you go. I knew you knew what I was talking about. Those things look creepy. Ooh, and they're so big. Um, but Janaea claims she liked the sound that the sounds that they made at night. So I'm like, you can have them. Um, but yeah, this print. I got to put on my bathroom door. I'm going to put it on after this haul. I've been waiting to put it on there because I think it's going to make that door look nice. Um, but I feel like this is a really elegant kind of print for your door. It's girly and it's a good indicator. Someone's at your house where the bathroom is so people don't go snooping around your house. But it is a pretty good size. Let me show you what it looks like large. And um, this one I paid, well, I didn't pay, but it was $1.79 when I ordered it. And as you see, it's $1.78 right now. But this is it, and, you know, it's full size. And it's just sticky on the back. So I'm hoping that this is going to dress up my door because I have a very plain, just a plain white door. Uh, you're a night owl. <laughs> so am I. I am a night owl. And I should not be but I cannot help it. It's in my DNA. Okay, so the next item we're going to share, we're going to move to the next order. That was the first order. The next order I'm going to uh, share with you are looks for autumn. I bought a bunch of shirts that I wanted to share with you guys, and it was a part of their autumn looks campaign. And what happened was this was the full order where everything they sent to me was just thrown in a bag like this, not original packaging. And I was really, again, like I said, I wasn't happy with that. I reached out to them. I told them I'm not comfortable because, you know, the whole object was to wear these and show you guys how they fit. But I'm like, I don't know if these are used or new returns. So I'm not going to do that. But they took care of everything and they allowed me to go ahead and participate in another campaign but keep these items here so i'm going to show them to you but i'm not going to try them on i need to wash them and make sure that i'm comfortable with these items so let me show you the price 
and the look and what they look like. And when you buy clothes, I always like to buy the clothes, I mean, to show the pictures of the clothes that I buy so you can see what made me buy them. So hold on, let me uh, close that up for you. So this is what the shirt looks like in real time. I bought everything in an XXL. I like my clothes loose. I don't like them tight. And I've always been that way when I was at my biggest, when I was at my smallest, I always want my clothes to be loose. I've never liked clothes hugging on too tight to me. It just isn't comfortable. So this is what the shirt looks like in real time. And I thought it would be great for the holiday season. I was like, it would be nice to have a nice red shirt to wear. This is what it looked like. This is the picture that made me want to buy this shirt. Um, yeah, you like them loose too? Yeah, I don't like anything tight. That goes with stuff on my head, my jewelry. You know how I like to dangle. I don't like anything tight. I just, and when I see people like all oh, choked up, it makes me uncomfortable just looking at them sometimes. But to each his own, I just don't like it. But I thought this was a nice shirt, you know, in the ad. And like I said, when I got it, it was the same price, $8.97. And it came in uh, all these different colors. White, which is pretty. It's pretty in the picture. Black, they all look nice. But you know, you got to get these things in real time to see if you're really going to like them. And this is a case where all of these looks are the same price. Sometimes the prices do vary. But this is the picture. And then this is the, in 3D, what it looks like here so this one fits it's okay um i mean it kind of looks true to what you see on the screen right so it's not off and it's not a bad looking shirt if i need to go somewhere you know over the holiday season then you know i can give this a try i gotta wash all these things first and make sure they're clean by my standards this is what the back looks like it's just plain nothing fancy just plain black and it's got a, a good length to it. So, yeah. So that's what this the first one is. The next item that I want to share with you is this one right here. This is a two-piece set. And this set was on sale. When I selected it, it was $10.99. And as you see now, it's $16.47. Oh, you like the green? What's your favorite color, Wavy? I'm curious. Now I can ask you since I got you in real time. You know what my favorite color is, but what is your favorite color? Because that was quite a bit of uh, options there. Just like here. Let's look at the green one right here. Ten, ooh, 1097. It's on sale. But that's kind of like an olive green. Um, and then what is this? This is a dark gray. So they have a multitude of colors here. Dark green versus that green. You know if the pink was on sale, I would have got it. This watermelon red, I'm not sure what that translates to, but here's the pink one. And this pink actually is more like a rose pink, but let's just look at the one that I got, the orange one. I like the brightness of the orange. Um, so here's what it looks like in real time. Let's see here. Okay, so this is the front right here. And I know this probably isn't doing it justice, which is why I'm glad I I'm able to show it to you on the screen. But these are the sleeves. You see how they get skinny right here? Let me, let me give you a point of reference. You see how the sleeve is fitting? On the picture, you can't really tell that much. Maybe right here. You can tell right here in this picture where they cinch in. And I didn't see that when I um, purchased it. I think I just looked at the main picture. So this part, I don't like how it feels because it kind of it kind of gets tight. And it's a little stretchy, but not stretchy enough for me. So I feel like when I put this shirt on, um, I would want to cut this part right here because this part didn't feel loose. Now, it's just a plain shirt, but the way they have it, you know, on, this is the design element but I don't think the feeling of it is going to work for me. And then the pants are just plain pants. Uh, let's turn it around again. So they're just plain pants with a drawstring like that. And they have good stretch to them. And it's just, just like a t-shirt material. 
that's all this is like cotton so it's not very heavy it's just a, like a cottony light t-shirt material so it's not going to keep you warm in the winter it's probably perfect for a good fall night you know where it's kind of breezy like sweater weather but not winter weather so this would be good for something like that you know you're going to a park a ball game something to that effect but yeah i um i don't like this little rouge part right here around the sleeves this kind of it just cinched in a little bit too much now this fabric close up looks nothing to me like this fabric can you see i know i'm not crazy let me put it close to the screen watch it probably look the same <laughs> but it doesn't though it's more like a t-shirt so that's a whole different fabric that in that 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 picture is showing i hope you can see that it is definitely not that this look right here that is definitely not the case i can assure you of that but anyways so that's what that one is let's go ahead and move on to the next item because i don't want to hold you too too long um so the next item we're going to share is this what is this one? Oh, now this one right here was my one of my favorites and you'll see why as soon as i show you definitely one of my favorites can you tell and it's off the shoulder this one i'm gonna enjoy wearing look at that bright hot pink and it says perfectly imperfect that one's cute this is the one this one there's two of them that are my favorite this is the first one and then i'll when i get to the other one i'll let you know what the other one is but this one they had two different uh pink options and i kept going back and forth which one do i want to get it's one of those off the shoulders you know like you put it on you throw down a shoulder this side or that side like she has in the picture um i paid or I, it was when i selected it let's see that's this is number three 1049 so this is on sale right now it's called a rose color i wouldn't necessarily call this rose i call that hot pink this is what the material looks like on the inside kind of see that kind of like a terry cloth material um but yeah so let's see here let's see if that's truly 939 this is the other color oh hold on let me show you okay this is the other color that i was trying to decide i love that one i had that in my card which one did you have in your card april i keep forgetting to look over here because <laughs> my phone is over to the left which one did you have in your card this one that i'm showing you now because i this is one of my favorites but this was the other color i was struggling with that pink versus what they call a rose color which one would you guys have picked between these two if you like pink? I think they're both beautiful. I love the one. I've had that in my cart. More hot pink. Yeah, I'm definitely, I think I picked the right one, but you got to admit this pink is pretty too because it's vibrant. And normally they're not as vibrant as they, you know, they appear to be, um, you know, when you're looking at them on a website, you get them and you're like, oh, it looks dull compared to what I saw on the website. But here are the other colors and it looks like the white one's nice too this is just a cute shirt all the colors really are cute i think this would be the one that i would like the least um you're with april <laughs> wavy me too or if the pink that pink perfectly more hot pink pink either pink is nice you already know i was struggling i almost got both of them but i'm like that's overkill um, here's red and then look at this red this red is nice too it's it's so perfect for the holiday season coming up so i love white but scared to wear white same here white would be destroyed with me but you would get that one good wear um <laughs> once you put it on for the first time but i really wanted to wear this one in a haul but i'm like i want to wash these things first but this was my favorite 939 so it's less than what i paid uh well less than what it, I didn't pay for it, but less than what it was when I ordered it. It's ten forty nine. So this is really a cute shirt, and it's heavy, by the way. It's not thin. It's not light. It's heavy, so it will keep you warm. And it's like a mid length uh, sleeve, but it's very, um, it's very warm. It'll keep you warm, so you don't have to do the shoulder thing, you know. But if you wanted to, 
you could, but it will keep you warmer and it's got a good length to it. So it's not just, you know, going to have your stomach and everything hanging all out if you don't like that. But this is, this was one of my favorite. Now the next shirt I'm going to share with you is this one here. Okay. This is the next shirt. And this is 809 now, and it was 899. So it's a little cheaper as well. So that's good to know. I mean, it's good to know on the sponsor ones that, you know, that I'm not losing. But this is, look at the colors are pretty much true to what they advertise. This is what the sleeve looks like. I like these kind of shirts that have these sleeves that zhuzh up with the little button and that they kind of have that little v-neck down the middle so this definitely looks true to what it looks like uh in the ad i'm going to show you it large in a minute but let me just show you full screen what it looks like and how far down it goes it's a great material it's nice and soft um it's very smooth i'm not sure what material to call this and they again there was no stickers or tags or anything so i don't even know anything about it there was no barcode no nothing but it's it feels good it's a good uh, silky kind of material not silk but maybe like a silk rayon cotton mix or something and it's got a little weight to it and that's what I like about it so it's gonna fall when you wear it it's not gonna fluff up and I just like that nice rich cranberry color so the I uh, the colors that these were available in is this one this uh apricot is what they call it that's really pretty too um looks loose and comfy yeah it's definitely loose and comfy red is not your color but looks good on someone else you know i like bright colors so next to pink red i'll do any time of the day um it's almost 12 there midnight it's almost midnight where you are yeah it's almost nine here um, and what else? We be, we in the same time zone. Um, looks loose and comfy. Yeah, this one, look at this apricot color. I like that one. I don't know that that would be a good color for me, but it's pretty. I'm always good with the black shirt. Um, again, this cranberry is a nice rich color, so I like that a lot. And then this one, army green. I almost looked brown when I first looked at it, but I'm not, I know a lot of people like green. So if you're a green person, this probably would be a shirt you would like. Green has just never been my color, but I know people who have green as their favorite color, but not me. I got to be bright and cheery and in your face. So that's that one. Then we've got three, four more to go and then we'll be done. So the next shirt that I'm going to share with you is this other one right here this was my other favorite and this one i actually wore already we'll see if you recognize it this one i thought i liked the saying of this one this is so positive self-love self-respect self-worth and self-confidence so this one i threw in the wash so i could wear it so I did wear this and it actually does have a tag on it. This says a hundred percent polyester. Now it looks like a t-shirt when you look at it. And let me give you a close up. That looks like a t-shirt to me. And that's what I thought it would be. But the way that it, the material, like this one, I guess the white one looks more polyester. And I'm probably just saying that now just because I just read the tag. <laughs> But the black one really looked just like a t-shirt to me. And even when I hold it up to you guys right now, you probably thought it was just a t-shirt. But it is a polyester, but it's like a cotton polyester. Even though it says 100% polyester, it feels like it has some kind of cotton in it to wear. Because I've never been a polyester girl. I never wear polyester stuff like that. Oh, wow, you have dollar, great Dollar Tree there. Oh, you guys are talking about your state. Love the black one. Um, yeah, so this one is comfortable. Now, this one fits, but it doesn't fit too hard. Like the last, I think I wore it in my purse collection video. The last video that I did, I was wearing this one, if I'm not mistaken. And it's very comfortable. I like this shirt. You see how it has that stretch to it? 
let me show you in, in real time. It's five dollars and thirty-seven cents now, and it was five dollars and thirty-nine cents when I selected it. So not much difference in price. Um, but yeah, look at the the gear that it has. It's very spongy and stretchy, so it's comfortable. Even though it's fitting, it's not like that tight fitting. It's a comfortable fitting when you put it on. It kind of conforms. It's not too loose and dragging. It just it's, it fits your body nicely, but it doesn't hug it too tight and make you feel comfortable. So this was my other favorite. This and the perfectly imperfect one. So let's move on to the next item. The next item is this one right here. This one was cute. I got it for the season, and you'll see why. Isn't this cute? Mickey, before you go, do you have Instagram? I do not have an Instagram. I should. My daughter is get, always gets on me like, you should have an Instagram. And I don't, but I need to get, find some time to get on Instagram. I just, I'm too stretched as it is. And I know that that would just take me over the edge right now. And she won't manage it for me. So, but if I do get one, I will let you know. I wish you had a store called Just a Buck. <laughs> I got some amazing t-shirts only. Wow. For $1.25? I live on a farm with about 100 different animals. What? Really? You know, I watch a lot of farm animal um, emails. I mean emails. Videos. Or an email. I If you go to my description, you'll see my email on there. Um, go to community tab, I think. That's where my email is. A um, hundred farm animals. Okay, so let me show you this shirt. Isn't this a cute shirt? Now this shirt was eight ninety nine when I selected it. It is now eight ninety seven, and it says uh, "Love Fall, y'all." And it's again, it's that same type of polyester type of material. But when I looked at this, it didn't. You never know what kind of material it's gonna be. This one's a little thinner. Like you can see, this is the inside. And this is the front and it's stretchy like that. So it's comfortable. It's, it's nice and loose, but not too loose. Um, but there's again, no tags or anything on it to really confirm. Oh, here we go. A hundred percent polyester. Yeah. It says a hundred percent polyester. So it's going to be easy to wash and take care of. It won't need to be, to be ironed. You just wash it and let it hang. That part is good, but I thought this was so cute, so appropriate for the season. And that's why I ordered it. And that's why I was bummed when it came and it just looked, you know, like somebody else had ordered it and sent it back. But that's a cute little look. Now, the only thing I could care less about is this animal print in it. But, you know, it goes the way they did it, you know. But the animal print, if I could take something out, it would be that. But it goes. It's the same color scheme the you know and so I like it and it feels good it's soft it's smooth so I'm going to enjoy wearing it and on that note here's shirt number seven because I was being festive and so I went ahead and got this one right here merry and bright now isn't this cute same idea same material same fit you know the same sleeve so come Christmas time I could wear this one and be comfortable so they were both $8.99 when I ordered them they're both now $8.97 actually all of these are $8.97 and I was really torn between the red Mary and bright I almost got three but I said just calm down just get one for each season uh, this one I thought was cute too they're all cute to me. I think these little designs are so cute. This is the one that I would not have got because it has a Santa on it. But I love them all. We have about 30 goats. There's cows, four pigs, and chickens. April, you are busy. It's a lot of work taking care of animals. And you don't like ironing with the passion. I buy stuff I don't need to iron. You know, I'm, I'm on that page now. I don't have time. I have an iron that hasn't seen the light of day in years, and it's probably not going to see it for another few years. Um, wow. They are cute. Yeah, these are all cute. I really like them. And as I'm looking at this black one, look at how fun that is. I don't know why I got that one over this one. 
I should have got this one. Hmm. I like this one better than, I mean, they're both cute, but as I'm looking at, I think it's because of the saying, because I'm, I just like this one. All right, I like them all. Let me just calm down. And then the last one I'm going to share with you is this item here. This last shirt is more of more of a dress. Actually, it's not the last item. There's two more. But the last item for these autumn looks is this shirt right here. Where's my... Okay, it's called the Solid Versatile Blouse. Now, this is a pretty blouse if you're going out, going to work. You know, it's it's very flexible. You can dress it up or down. I got it in this color. I thought it was a nice color. What do they call this color? They call this pink. Really? This is more like a peach. I can't even say it's a light pink. I don't know what it's looking like for you guys, but it's more like a peach color. It's not pink. Even in this picture on the screen, it looks peach to me. Now this is pink. Or they call this rose red. So six ninety seven. It was six ninety nine when I got this pink one. Um, but this pink I didn't get because that to me is just was a little bit too much. And I already had enough black ones. That's why I didn't get black. And so I thought this was a nice... I thought this actually was more like a tan, like a bone color. But they actually call it pink. That's interesting. But it, again, it feels nice. It's a, a nice shirt. It's The material's nice and heavy. It's got weight to it. It's got the little cap sleeves here on the side. So it's not, you know, bare uh, arms... It gives your arm some coverage and it's just a nice fabric it's you know again wavy it's wash and wear <laughs> you know it doesn't need to be ironed it's got a nice length to it so it's a nice shirt I like it but I wouldn't call this pink though I would call this more like a tan or a bone color even when I put it under the light it is not pink to me so there you go now, there's, that was it for the Autumn Looks uh, sponsored haul. Now, let me get these last two items over here and we can be done. Now, this last two items, the first one is, let's see, first one here. This is one that I forgot to include when I was doing my purse collection. And the reason that I forgot to include this is because I never hauled it yet anyways. It was it's still it was still waiting to be hauled. And so I went ahead and pulled it out because I knew I had one more and I said, I'll just add this to the purse collection. But at the end of all of that, I still forgot to include it. So I said, let me, and I had it out to include. So I just said, let me just throw it in at the end of this one. It's a cute little bag. It's $7.98 right now in the coffee color. However, when I bought this, it was $3.35. So this is how it came. Let me just unbag it for you so you can see what it looks like in real time. This is what it came in. Now, you know, it's just a nice, a light little light bag, nothing serious. Uh, it's got this little decorative bar, gold bar across the top. It's not very you know, expensive, not a real expensive type of bag. It's got this pocket on the side. It's got this little handle here at the top. And then it zips open. So, oh, it has two zippers, actually. It's got one. What is this? Oh, this is the strap. So here, I'll show you that in a minute. I just want to show you right here that it has two zippers. So the first one is unzipped already. And then here's the second one. So it opens up on two sides, but it's still just one main pocket. And this is how wide it opens up like that. So it can carry a good, a decent amount of stuff. You look at it like that. And Janae might like this one. There's no pocket on the inside. There's no slip pocket, no sleeve pocket. And then there's no zipper pocket. So it's just one um, area on the inside. And then the strap that comes with it, it's a nice, it's a chintzy little thin one not anything uh, too thick or too heavy goes along with the quality of the purse you know loose strings here and whatnot the hardware is kind of light um, it's not very heavy duty it does have the swivel effect 
and then it has the cute words of love so this is the length of the strap it's probably gonna get you crossbody if you're nice and petite if nothing else you'll get shoulder but it's cute it goes along with you know it's just a cute little purse it has the little D rings here on the side um, it, let's see so when you put the strap on you know it's a cute little look with the strap and everything so Janae might like this one if not I'll find somebody who probably would like this purse I don't necessarily think it's for me now that I've gotten other bags this bag has been sitting here for a minute so I've got other ones that will trump this one easily <laughs> So the last item I'm going to share with you, and let me just show you that large in case you guys want to see the other selection. So this one is $7.98 right now. It's coffee. This one is white, and it's $7.98. Then they have the pink option, same price. The black one, this is a little quilted looking one, and that one's $4.58. $6.08 for the white quilted one. 608 for the gray one and 608 for the pink quilted so the best deal right now is this quilted black one okay so if you were interested in that that's what's going on there the last item i'm going to share with you and then this haul will be over is this one right here and this i thought it was just nice to have a nice message love jesus and this one, I it was 107. It's still 107, and it comes in this Ziploc, Ziploc, in this plastic bag, not Ziploc. Opening is here, and this is one of those corded bracelets that I thought was nice, where it looks like you're wearing multiple bracelets, but it's really just one. I really love how it has love and Jesus and the cross. You guys know I like my crosses. So let me see if I can fasten this up to give you the visual of what it looks like. But I thought that was nice. Um, you're rocking, <laughs> you are rocking with the purses. Which purse from Timu has been your favorite? Oh, I would say the, the, um, that big, that, uh, the biggest one that I ordered in the brown where it had the little wallet insert. And the strap, it kind of looked like that uh, Louis Vuitton, um, what did they call that one now? I can't believe I can't think of the name. She got so many favorites. I've been looking at them. Keep it. Oh, it's driving me crazy. Oh, the Neverfull. That, the small size and the Neverfull, the imitation one that Timu did in the brown triangles. That's my favorite one. And then the next to that is the three purse the part yeah the purse that has the three pieces to it the two small handbags and then the the little coin purse that sits on the strap that's my second favorite and then the two and then my third favorites are those two they are neck and neck and it's the the also the louis vuitton what are those called now Ugh. you know when you get on camera you just can't remember stuff it drives me crazy um, but those are my next two evenly. So that, that would be my top three of the Timu bags that are my favorites. Now this bracelet, I'm trying to see if I can get it. I think this is so cute. I, I like the cross. I like where it says love and Jesus. You know, we need more of this in the world today. Um, <clears throat> let's see if I can fast. Well, I'm not going to try to fast, but I'm going to show you this way. I just think it's cute how it really comes across like it's a bunch of different ones, but it's really only one. And for a buck seven, you know, you can't go wrong. And then let's look at the different uh, colors that it comes in. You can get it in black. You can get it in white. You can get it in blue, brown, and lastly, pink. Now, Stuff like this, I wouldn't buy in pink. When I when I go for jewelry, it's normally silver and rhinestones. Or if there's black, that would make sense. It would be a black. But like this is where I kind of don't do a lot of cover, colors when it comes to jewelry like this. But my favorite one on this is the black one. And for a great price, great message. So I just wanted to share that because I forgot to share this in the actual order 
when I ordered it and I hauled all of that stuff. I forgot because it slipped somewhere on my uh, desk and I said, darn it, I'm always forgetting something. So today, I feel like I was pretty organized. What do you guys think about that? Did I do good? Um, let me know. You know, I'm always forgetting something or saying something wrong or missing something. So, um, but yeah, I think I did pretty good today. I'm getting used to this. And I got my phone here. I got all my screens. And so if you guys see anything that you like on here, just remember all the links to everything will be in the description box as well as in the first pinned comment. And if you are interested in purchasing anything, you know I have a discount code, OPT43129. Save 50% off of your first order if you're a first time user. And then you'll also get a $100 coupon bundle. And even if you're not sure you wanna order something, just go ahead and download the app on your phone. That would really help me out and it would help me get to level seven in the influencer program because I need five more people to just download that app. Even if you didn't buy anything, but you're gonna see something one day and you're gonna to wanna to buy it and you'll already be prepared. So if you're thinking about it, just go ahead and download the app and then just you know save it for later. It'll help me out a lot, like I said. Thanks, April. I, I appreciate that support and wavy like the ocean. I'm so glad we had a chance to catch each other. I've been trying to catch up with you since I've been doing these. So thank you. Wavy like the ocean is always commenting on every video I've ever done. Like she's always the first comment faithfully, always supportive, always consistent. So that's why I know that name so well. So she's my special friend out there and I do appreciate you wavy. And I look forward to your comments every time I put up a video. So I am glad that I caught up with you tonight. Um, you ordered like over 36 times. You have no idea how many times I've ordered. I have, so I got three orders still coming. I got boxes right here. So you guys are gonna be seeing a lot more of me. Um, and doing these hauls live just makes it so much easier for me because I don't have to do all of that editing, but I can still get you the information you need to see as far as what it looks like and the price. I think that's so important. So on that note, I'm going to stop rambling. I'm gonna go ahead and close out this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and spending a little bit of your time with me. I always appreciate it. I appreciate everyone who takes the time to come in and comment and to just look at my videos and just let me know with a thumbs up that you like the videos and you like this content. So I will see you all in the next one. You guys have a great evening. Stay safe. And for those of you who are cold, stay warm. And if you are in Cali, I am looking forward to some cooler temperatures, but not cold, just cooler. So you guys, I'll see you in the next one. And just, you know, look out for me when you see my hauls. I'm going to try to give you some notice, but if I don't, if I'm not able to do that, then just kind of look out for me because I like to sneak in and sneak out. So with that being said, I'm going to sneak out right now and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.